The success story of the computerization of the income tax department is a milestone in the governance history of India. The digital ecosystem of the income tax department stands as an exemplary model that is based on the principles of ease of doing business, digital payment of tax and stellar user interface and experience. Embracing the digital era with remarkable foresight, the department adopted computers early on, embarking on a journey marked by perseverance and innovation. Over the years, it has continuously evolved, revolutionizing its processes to set a global benchmark for efficiency and taxpayer convenience. This inspiring journey from resilience to revolution showcases the department's commitment to progress and its pivotal role in shaping the future of taxation. Attempts at computerization began in 1967, when 10 Honeywell systems were provided by the USA to India and three of them were allocated to compile statistics for the income tax department. But the journey truly accelerated in 1981 with the creation of the Directorate of Income Tax Systems, the installation of the tax accounting system with ORG 2001 and SN23 computers in 1981 marked the beginning of a new era. The department transitioned from manual ledgers to installation of microprocessor-based electronic data processing system along with data entry system. The task was immense, digitizing records, automating processes, and training the staff. In 1985-86, three computer centers were set up in Chennai, Mumbai, and Delhi, with SN73 computers for processing of chalans and TDS salary returns. In 1987, the Electronic Data Processing EDP cadre was created to recruit skilled professionals to address the challenges posed by technological advancements. In 1991-92, the computer activities were subsequently extended to pan allotment, tan allotment, and payroll accounting system that made computers more prevalent for tasks including tax assessments, statistical analysis, record keeping and processing of tax returns. In the year 1993, based on the recommendations of the Chalaya Committee, a comprehensive plan was approved for computerization of the department. In pursuance of this, regional computer centers were set up in Delhi, Mumbai, Chennai, in 1994-95, equipped with RS-6000 servers and PCs were provided to the officers of these cities for the first time. Thereafter, the National Computer Center was established in Delhi during 1996-97, making a significant milestone in the department's computerization. To further streamline operations, 33 regional computer centers were established in 1996. These were connected to the National Computer Center through leased lines. Faster networks utilizing leased data for LAN and WAN connectivity, robust servers became the backbone of this new infrastructure along the modernization of taxpayer accounting systems. Thereafter, the network expanded dramatically, connecting 57 additional cities to the regional computer centers and the national computer center. During the period 1997 to 1999, PCs were provided to all the assessing officers across the country in a phased manner. With the dawn of the new millennium, the income tax department continued its foray into technology coupled with a massive restructuring exercise to administer direct taxation. In 2002, DT01 project, an ambitious initiative of fully computerizing tax return and establishing a robust management information system was undertaken under the aegis of Canadian International Development Agency, CIDA. The Kelkar Task Force in 2002 emphasized leveraging IT for high-quality taxpayer services, following which non-core functions such as the receipt and processing of PAN applications were outsourced to UTIITSL and NSDL, while the processing of TAN applications was outsourced to NSDL, streamlining operations and enhancing efficiency. In 2002, the launch of the department's national website www.incometaxindia.gov.in forged a crucial link between the department and taxpayers. The introduction of the online tax accounting system in 2004 allowed taxpayers to file returns and make payments online. 
The TIN Taxpayer Identification Number website launched in 2005 was designed to streamline tax administration by enabling the verification of tax payments claimed in TDS returns and ITRs, digitizing TDS processes, generating PAN ledgers and providing access to tax credit statements and refund status. As a result of these initiatives, the department received a Silver Icon Award for professional excellence in process re-engineering in 2005, followed by a Golden Icon Award for outstanding performance in service delivery in 2006. These prestigious accolades were presented at the national conferences on e-governance, highlighting our exceptional achievements in both process optimization and service delivery. Launched as a pilot in 2007, the Refund Banker Scheme facilitated automated refund processing, making it swift and hassle-free for both tax administrators and the taxpayer and the debut of an extra less returns enhanced taxpayer convenience and boosted trust in India's financial system. The 2008 Sevottam scheme introduced the Citizens Charter and Ayakar Seva Kendra ASK to streamline services and established a benchmark for excellence in service delivery. A transformative shift occurred as e-payment for direct taxes was made mandatory for companies and taxpayers subject to tax audits. As the economy grew and the taxpayer base expanded, the department required a more reliable system to manage tax returns effectively. To address this, a business process re-engineering BPR study was conducted, leading to the segregation of bulk functions from compliance tasks. A major milestone was the establishment of the Centralized Processing Center in Bengaluru in 2009, mandated by the Finance Act of 2008. The Central Processing Centre was set up in the year 2009 with an endeavour to digitise the processing of income tax returns. Over this journey of 15 years, there has always been a focus on providing better taxpayer service as also to improve on the speed of processing of tax returns. The returns that are filed electronically are processed at Central Processing Centre and the refunds are issued in electronic mode, thereby making the entire process seamless. Over the years, the performance has increased from handling 60 lakh returns in the first year to 8.46 crores in the last financial year 23-24. The e-filing system launched in 2012 marked a new era in tax administration. It has been the endeavour of the department to deliver best-in-class services to the taxpayers. Being a pioneer in digitalization, the e-filing portal has been a single window for all taxpayer services. The pre-filled returns, the wizard-based filing, campaigns, reminders and ease of payment of taxes have all contributed to a transformative nudge which has made filing and compliances easier and better. The e-filing portal with its speed and the upfront validations has ensured that processing is faster and refunds are easier. The Tax Administration Reform Commission, formed in 2013, emphasized greater use of information and communication technology in tax administration to address taxation issues and drive reforms. Inaugurated in 2013, the dedicated centralized processing cell, CPC, for TDS led to a significant advancement in tax administration. The TDS Reconciliation Analysis and Correction Enabling System, Traces Portal, stands as the pinnacle of TDS processing systems, meticulously matching and processing TDS returns to ensure precise tax credits. Form 26AS shows all taxes paid, emphasizing non-intrusive administration. These initiatives of the Income Tax Department towards promoting outstanding taxpayer services garnered the prestigious Prime Minister's Award for Excellence in Public Administration in 2012-2013. For easy tax compliance through quality services, the Traces Initiative of the CPC TDS Income Tax Department further received Gold Award in the National Award for E-Governance for Excellence in Government Process Re-Engineering in 2014-2015. This was followed by yet another milestone, the Income Tax Business Application which revolutionized internal processes, empowering income tax officers to efficiently manage audits, penalties, appeals, compliance, searches and in investigations among other critical functions. The project inside is data warehouse of income tax department. We gather information from the internal sources that is CPC, CPC, TDS, ITVA and from the external sources such as GST and CBIC, MCA, etc. All this information is utilized for creation of a robust tax profile. 
to boost precision and efficiency, Project Insight was initiated in 2015 to collect, refine, compile and analyze data from various sources. With the power of advanced data analytics, it streamlined the e-verification of tax returns, significantly improving the detection of tax evasion and ensuring a more transparent tax system. Launched by the Honorable Prime Minister in August 2020, the Transparent Taxation Honoring the Honest was a landmark initiative which introduced the faceless assessment regime with the objective of increasing the efficiency, transparency and accountability in the processes. This was a significant step towards streamlined tax assessments and appeals by eliminating in-person interactions between taxpayers and officials. As of July 31st, 2024, 6.76 lakhs faceless assessments and 2.83 lakhs faceless appeals have been completed under this initiative. Sathyo, कोशिश ये है कि हमारी टैक्स प्रणाली सीमलेस हो पेनलेस हो फेसलेस हो वी कुड शो दैट इन द मैटर ऑफ टू ईयर्स सिंस आफ्टर द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ फेसलेस यू आर एबल टू बी अ लॉट मोर कंफर्टेबल विद एग्जीक्यूटिंग योर सर्विस थ्रू द यूज ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी एंड एज मच मेकिंग द टैक्स एसेस comfortable with a simplified system the e verification scheme introduced in 2021 allows the income tax department to notify taxpayers about discrepancies in the third party income details the provision for updated returns became effective from 2022 this allows taxpayers to revise their income tax returns itrs by correcting errors or omissions these measures have improved voluntary compliance in taxpayers 2.26 crore pans were selected for e campaigns in financial year 2022-23 and financial year 2023-24 33.61 lakhs itrs were updated or revised after e campaigns as a result rupees 24972 crores additional tax was realized The annual information statement app introduced in 2022 provided taxpayers with a comprehensive view of their data Demand Facilitation Center is a part of IEC 2.0. Its objective is to resolve all outstanding demands either by collection or by correction. It does this by bringing all the stakeholders, the jurisdictional assessing officer, taxpayer and the chartered accountant on a common platform and adopts a nudge approach. It became operational in August 2022 and as on date has resolved 269000 demands amounting to 820000 crores. From April 1, 2023, TIN 2.0 replaced OLTAS, offering a single window platform for tax payments. The revamped Income Tax India website and e-verification of returns has set new benchmarks for taxpayer services. We celebrate a milestone today. Not long ago, the Income Tax Department operated on paper. Filing return was a cumbersome process for everyone. Driven by vision an innovation the department embarked on a digital transformation journey thanks to tireless efforts state of the art information technology systems are now in place these systems prioritize efficiency transparency and accountability in taxpayer services looking ahead we are committed to leveraging emerging technologies to further enhance the user experience आज भारत दुनिया के उन चुनिंदा देशों में है जहां टैक्स पेयर के अधिकारों और कर्तव्यों दोनों को क्वालिफाई किया गया है इनको कानूनी मान्यता दी गई है टैक्स पेयर और टैक्स कलेक्टर करने वाले के बीच विश्वास बहाली के लिए पारदर्शिता के लिए ये बहुत बड़ा कदम रहा है द डिजिटल ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन ऑफ द इनकम टैक्स डिपार्टमेंट हैज हार्नेस द पावर ऑफ ए आई एंड मशीन लर्निंग टू रेवोल्यूशनाइज द टैक्स सिस्टम इम्प्रूविंग एफिशियंसी एंड एक्यूरेसी टू एनहांस द टैक्स प्रोसेसेस दिस हैज लेड टू अवेंटीन पॉइंट सेवन परसेंट इंक्रीज इन रेवेन्यू कलेक्शन इन द एफ वाई टू थाउजेंड एंड ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी फोर एम्पावरिंग द गवर्नमेंट टू फंड असेंशियल इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर प्रोजेक्ट एंड सोशल वेलफेयर इनिशियटिव क्रिटिकल टू इंडियाज प्रोग्रेस A total of 7.41 crore ITRs were filed during this financial year till date which marks an increase of 7.5% over the same point of time last year. Of the returns filed more than 4.98 crore cases pertaining to assessment year 2024-25 have been processed. 
of these processed returns, as many as 3.92 crore returns, which is about 79% have been processed in less than 15 days. Among the returns processed, more than 2 crore returns were involving claim of refund in 1.73 crore cases and refund in those cases has already been issued the robust IT infrastructure of the department. The rise in return filings and revenue collections reflects greater compliance and voluntary taxpayer participation in nation-building efforts. It is incumbent upon us to associate with the projects closely today as they are going to be enablers for putting in place efficient technology-enabled systems for the next 7 to 10 years. I would request all to volunteer and take initiatives and proactive steps towards making contributions in this area. Therefore, the T of Prudent promises to put in place an advanced, technologically enabled tax administration for the nation. The volume of data which is processed on a daily basis in the Directorate of Systems is unparalleled compared to any other tax administration of the world. Till date, 76.83 crore pans have been allotted out of which 63 crore pans have been linked with Aadhaar. From April 2024 till date, 3.34 crores chalans of tax payment have been filed by taxpayers involving an amount of Rs 8.19 lakh crores. During the same period, total number of logins on the e-filing portal were 63.82 crores. In the last financial year, the Insight portal handled more than 650 crore informations including reports from reporting entities, deductive records, returns filed, etc. A total of 75.02 lakh STAN have been issued till date. Since its inception, CPC TDS has handled 12.69 crores TDS statements. Income Tax Department Secured Tax Net Network connects 775 offices spread across the nation. The national website of Income Tax Department had more than 1,116 crore hits from nearly 22 crore visitors during the last financial year. Guided by the ageless principle of righteous tax collection, the saga of the Income Tax Department is a testament to visionary leadership, unwavering dedication and relentless innovation. It's the tale of a determined few who, fueled by duty and patriotism, overcame obstacles to create a system that is efficient, transparent and trustworthy. This journey is not just about technology, but about building a stronger, more prosperous India, anchored in the trust of its people.